in this video i'll be teaching you how to make a draw lightning like this okay join me as a journey into this all right so very simple you can just drag your picture into your correct draw or you can just import it from your correct draw any of the two just very simple and first thing i need to do right here i'll just have to convert this picture into a grayscale which is black and white so you can just go to your bitmap then go to mode then you can just convert to convert to grayscale just very simple like that so and i would like to um adjust the the black and white the darkness rather so you can just go to your effect then go to adjust then you will see gamma over there so you can just click on gamma and you can adjust your gamma you can make it lighter you can make it darker depending on the kind of picture you are using okay just very simple and after i'm done with the the setting um with the darkness and i'll just click ok then we have this like this so once you're done with that you can just go to your bitmap convert it to bitmap so you can just set it as rgp after converting it okay so you can just have your image then go to your effect go to adjust and go to image laboratory image adjustment lab so you can just have it like this so so we are diving into the lightning effect so you can always adjust your color any you can make it of any color of your choice either red green blue any color of your choice just make sure you set your color to to the to the one you want or to any color of your choice so you can i'll be making use of blue for this so i can just set it to cyan and i'll be making use of magenta for the other one like if you go to studio you can see some lightning effect of blue and a red color something like that so we are just trying to do that then i'll make the second one a red color so which is magenta i'll be making use of magenta for the second one okay so and let me just adjust the color right here so let's do that together all right so once i'm done doing with the color so i can just click on ok right here so once i click on ok it automatically apply on the the image so by clicking okay so it apply on the on the image just very simple like that so you can make it of any of any color of your choice then you can try to zoom in if you are okay you can you can zoom in with your mouse and you can zoom out also so okay we are okay with this color then one thing i would like to do is that okay um i'll make use of transparency too i'll make use of transparency to to fade in some parts so it depends on the uh, the lightning effect where you want to have so i'm just trying to have it blue at the left blue at the left and magenta at the right at the right so and based on if you want your horn to be at the top or bottom so you can just make your transparency to like that so i would just like to make use of transparency to, to fade in some part of the cyan and likewise fading some part of the magenta so once you are done you are going to highlight the two then you press c on your keyboard you press c e and c that is you are just trying to align the two pictures at center and vertically so you're trying to adjust the picture together so it was very simple so and you can see we have something like this just very cool and you know you can always try your phone you can just make use of any picture of your choice and very simple like that so I hope you enjoyed this video so i'd like you to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like share with your friends thank you for watching